Stand by. Stand by. Stand by. Go. Here we go. That's right, today we are going to check out uh, Blood and Truth on the PlayStation VR in combination with a haptic suit. The one that I'm actually wearing righty tighty now. It's from B Haptics. It's going to be an absolute blast. I just can't wait to dive in. I hope you are going to join me on this epic adventure. Blood and Truth is an action-packed uh, shooter, by the way, and where you star in your own explosive blockbuster movie, you will battle your way through the crime-ridden London underworld as a lead soldier, Ryan Marks, in your deadliest mission yet, and that is to save your family from a ruthless criminal empire. This will require you to take out your targets with over-the-top epic gunplay as you drive, parachute and rappel across the city. And that sounds like music to my ears. Quick heads up, this is a PSVR exclusive, just so you know. And the haptic suit I'm wearing will be in the description below as well. So if you want to know more about it, what it's capable of and what it exactly does, then uh, have a look, it's super interesting and quite cool, of course. Now it's time to jump into the metaphors and uh, have some fun. Let's go! Zero, this is Nomad 2 1. I've reached the compound. Going in. Over. Weapon check. Weapon good. Ammo good. Entering compound. Beginning extraction. Over. Shoot the catch. Sneaky, sneaky. Yeah. This will come in handy. I'm afraid we have been uh, compromised. Better get out of here real quick. Hasta la vista, baby. Whoa. Oh no, oh no. Here. I'm not interested. I thought British special forces were to die. Whoa, 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 whoa. Personal bubble, hello. X rays down. Surprise! They know I'm here anyway, so... Ooh, what do we have over here?
Tada! Where's the rest of your unit? Oh, we have Doors reinforced. Looks like I'm going in loud. Preparing breach. Prime the charge. Marks, I thought I was gonna have to rescue myself. Oh, fair enough. I'll be off then, shall I? <laughs> hey, you fucker, come on. Pick the lock. Clear. Give me a combat estimation. Route in. I had eyes on seven to ten x-rays with longs and five x-rays with shorts. Best estimate. Okay, go. Comms check. Roger that. Weapon check. Ammo good. Weapon good. Safety off? Always. Firm, move. Stand by. Stand by. Stand by. Go. Here we go. That's it, get in. Get in. Go. Daria, brace yourself. Oh, this is nice, man. You should get one. If you ever get your license back. <laughs> Fuck off. Oh, these fuckers aren't going to give up without a fight, mate. Roger that. Out. Call back to base. It doesn't sound good, does it? No. How you been? Yeah, you know me. And how's mum doing? She just lost her husband. How do you think she's doing? Yeah. <laughs> it was fucking sudden, though. Don't think it's hit her yet. Don't think it's hit any of us. No. 
Look, he was no angel, but just thought he'd make it through to the end. No one big enough to take him on. Things were running smoothly. What the fuck is that? I'm trying to quit smoking. And carbs. Carbs? Yeah. Do you know an apple was basically one big carb? <laughs> so I've given up fruit. Well, what about beer? Uh, beer's not fruit, it's grain. <laughs> Here, try it. Oh, fuck's sake, Ryan. Good to see you too. Prick. <laughs> Right then, get this over with. Yeah. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Come on then. And that was the intro of Blood and Truth, in a nutshell. This is a short version of it. No problem, man, I'll take care of it. Thanks, Clint. service. Flowers were lovely. Your dad would have hated it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, would. God, you look just like him. He wasn't much younger than you when we met. When was that? 1937. He was a lot funnier than you, though. <laughs> <laughs> What's going on? Ah, stay behind me. Get in! They're all over us! Right, right. Ah! Put the weapons down. Now! Oh, fuck. Clint, do as she says. Ah. Ah. Don't move. Listen, love. You don't know who the fuck you're dealing with. Just put the gun. Fuck. Fuck. He moved. Anne, do you know I am? <laughs> yeah, of course you do. For those of you that don't, my name is Anthony Sharp. I'm a businessman. And like all good businessmen, I like to seek out new opportunities. Oh, for fuck's sake. I've just buried my husband. Yeah, I know. And it's a terrible thing. But like I said, new opportunities. The thing is, it's very difficult getting you all together. And my offer is for the whole family. Yeah, can we hurry this up, Tone? I've got a date tonight. You open your fucking mouth again, and I'm gonna put a bullet through her face. You can fuck off back to the army. And I know what you're thinking. You're tempted to push back, but I strongly advise against that. I don't want this to be a hostile takeover. I'm sure you don't. I've got a lot of respect for you, Anne. You're a clever woman. You'll do the right thing. All right. Well, I think I've just about done here. This is my brother, Keech. He is the absolute best with numbers. And he's going to make sure that this transition runs smoothly. Right. I need ledgers, receipts, contact books, diaries, you name it. I want to know when you last saw your fucking proctologist. Come on, chop chop. Someone clear that. How many are there? Six, maybe eight. I'll tell you what, this accountancy lark is hard fucking going. <laughs> oh, I'm going to do him. Nick. Might try some of this scotch. Celebrate our new union. <laughs> Who's gonna pour it for me? How about one of the Marx brothers? Here. Which one's Groucho? <laughs> <laughs> now that's actually pretty good. Yeah. Did you hear that, Ryan? Our surname's Marx, and we're brothers. <laughs> so that makes us the Marx brothers. Ah. <laughs> Did you just think of that, kid? <laughs> <laughs> or you, Annie. Go on. Have a little drink with me. <laughs> we could do shots. <laughs> shots. <laughs> Won't be doing any shots with that. <laughs> eh? So 
safety zone. Hey? No, I ain't. <laughs> Mark's family in action. Talk about a well-oiled machine. That's some serious gangster shit right there. We know where Tony's gonna be tonight. Private party at his casino. Great, you might as well be on fucking Mars. Yeah, he'll be surrounded by his best people. Then the last thing he'll expect is me turning up. No way, Ryan. You are keeping well out of this. It could work. No, it's madness. Could you do it? I can do it. Did you hear what I just said? You are not getting involved. But I'm already involved. I could be in and out of there before anyone knows what's happened. I deal with situations and people a lot heavier than Tony Sharp. Ryan's right. What the fuck are you thinking? Tony won't stop here. We know that. Mum, Ryan's trained for this. Anyone else, you wouldn't think twice. But it isn't anyone else, is it, Nicholas? It's your brother. Okay, okay, fine. At least we know where Tony will be tonight. We can keep an eye where he goes afterwards and then pick our moment. Why risk waiting? If we've got a chance to take him down, we should do it. All right. But the first sign of trouble, Ryan, we get you out of there. Of course. What weapons we got? Let's have a look. Ryan, we're inside. This place is crawling with Tony's dodgy mates. Okay, in and out, as fast as we can. Sounds like a plan to me. I'm uh, totally getting into this story. It's, uh, it's amazing. Okay, so I just saw our old friend Cage. You obviously didn't hit him hard enough. Roger that. Come on, AD. You can do this. This is uh, quite tough. Oh, oh, I'm getting the hang of this. Oh, jackpot. On there, messing around. Listen up, everyone. Mr. Sharp won't be attending tonight after all. He wants the night to be a success. So act like he's still the guest of honor and behave yourselves. Ooh. Ryan, did you hear that? Tony's not even fucking here. Tony's not here. But Keech is. There he is. Camera one. Kitch. Where is he going? That's it. Why is he so angry? Found him. Room 53. And shutting down power now. Cameras are offline. Time to go. <gasps> Tony likes it done by the book. Then why let Keach run the place? Slimy bastard. Maybe, but he's not stupid. Let's finish off the search. Okay, okay. that Jack the Ripper. Placing the C4. Now the detonator. Activated. Needs a good spread of C4 around the room. Okay. Let's uh, get this uh, party started. Another 
perfect spot. Alright, something. It was a close one. <laughs> and one here. More ammunition, always welcome. See that? <laughs> what a noob. Now let's go talk to Keach. See what we can find out about Tony. Try the lift. It should still be working. It's a me! An 80! Oh no! Not again! Oh! Wait for it, wait for it! And. Strike! Run 53. Ryan, we need him alive. Knock, knock. All right, Keach, remember me. Oh, shit. Ryan, don't let him get away. Ooh. Are we really? seriously? Get someone on five. He's going to kill me. Going to do this. Shoot him, shoot him. Oh, I gotta reload. Ha, <laughs> nice try. Out the fucking way, you idiot! I'll make you pay for that! Just in time. He's coming for me! He's catching up! 
Just give oh, up. God. Don't shoot Ryan. He can lead us to Tony. All right, all right. Where's Tony? I don't know. I'm just his brother. He never tells me anything. Bullshit. I swear I don't know. Don't lie to me. I don't fucking know, all right? Keach. Listen, I, I barely see him these days. He spends all his time with... You little prick! Friend. You better run! Whoa. Okay, we got it. We gotta make a run for it. It was a rough landing. <laughs> nice one. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> What's that music? It's coming from the club. Attention, all security personnel. We can't rate the time club immediately. Yeah. I've got their attention. Yeah. Request an urgent assistance. Repeat, urgent assistance. Then let's make some noise. Put your hands up in the air! <laughs> whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> oh, I love this. Boom! Okay. Oh, fire. Ooh. You party pooper, what are you doing? Wow. What a douche. Stuff. Oh, he's coming closer. Oh. Too slow. That's me. Oh no, 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 Grenade the out! Bye! Yes. Nice to meet you too. Guys, I'm heading for the door. I'll see you at the car. Shit, they've clocked me. Take her down! Take her down! I've got your back, Michelle. You're clear. Nick! Don't wait for me. I'll cover you. Man down. Request urgent assistance. Time to uh, wrap this party up.
This is my town, okay? My party. My rules. I'm in the alley with the car, Ryan. Hurry! Michelle, keep the engine running. I'm on my way. And that was a uh, quick sneak peek of Blood and Truth on this uh, channel. I hope you enjoyed watching this, uh, this video. If you did, then be sure to, well, slam a like on this video. That would be nice. It lets me know you care and yeah, I gotta say, it blows my mind how interactive this action title is. There is so much you can do besides shooting an enemy. Uh, you can put your middle finger up in the air, flip your gun like a CSGO player would do, using a slot machine, catch grenades, lockpick doors and safes, play C4, uh, vape and much more. Let's say you can pretty much grab everything you want that is in range and that's that's so fun it's it's great officially this game is a seated experience by the way but i played it standing and it worked fine it's just a little weird when your character starts to crouch or crawl since it feels like your actual buddy goes through the floor hopefully they will support both uh, play styles in the near future time will tell we'll see but uh yeah anyways uh, the point to point movement in blood and truth is forgivable there were so many people out there that were worried about the locomotion in this uh, shooter game but looking at the spot hitting the trigger and then start moving is not bad at all the only downside is that there is no option for you to explore a location by using your move controllers it is an unreal shooter after all so yeah this is this is what you are getting into then uh, it didn't annoy me at all to be honest it felt quite natural and also arcadey in a way yeah uh, the shooting mechanics are as satisfying when I first used them in the London Heist. This was a true throwback for sure. Uh, you can even customize your weapons now with spray paint and attachments. You unlock these attachments by uh, collecting targets that are hidden throughout the game. There are plenty of challenges packed in each level, so keep your eyes open. Uh, the story is amazing by the way, it's a bit over the top from time to time, I agree but that keeps the pace going. I really felt like I was a part of the Marx family and that's something that will draw me back in game. Having this personal relationship with characters is super important and they definitely nailed that in Blood and Truth. So yes, that's the, that's the power of interaction in VR right there. If you are interested in this, uh, in this title, then be sure to check out the link in the description below. And now it's time for me to, well, sign off. And as I always say, and I see you all next time. See you in the metaverse. Bye bye. See ya later. Say Ryan.